F1 News, Sebastian Vettel makes lucky claim despite coming 8th in Chinese Grand Prix The German had won the previous two races of the 2018 F1 season but slumped in China, finishing behind Renault's Nico Hülkenberg and McLaren's Fernando Alonso as well as his title rivals, including Lewis Hamilton. Hamilton's fourth place finish meant that Vettel still remains nine points ahead in the Drivers' Championship but he was undoubtedly frustrated by his result in Shanghai, his worst in 30 races since coming home ninth at the 2016 British Grand Prix. Yet the main reason for that was Vettel's collision with Verstappen at the hairpin, with the over-exuberant Dutchman locking up his rear wheels and sliding into Vettel's side to send both spinning. The incident did not end either of the pair's races, with both able to complete the final 13 laps, but Verstappen received a 10-second penalty and surrendered his hopes of a podium finish in the process. The 20-year-old apologized to Vettel after the race, taking full blame for their contact, with the four-time world champion acknowledging that it could have been far worse as he revealed he would not have fought Verstappen's attempts to overtake because of his weary tires. He told Ferrari's official website, I was lucky to end my race. After a collision like the one I had, I think we could have even stopped there. Obviously, the lucky thing is that the car was still working, even if the balance was gone. We lost the lead after the pit stop and that was not ideal. We were quite sure we would have come out in front, but we didn't. The timing of the safety car was bad for both me and, Mercedes rival, Valtteri, Bottas, because we had no chance to react. After that it was clear that Red Bull was faster and I think there was no point to resist much at the way Daniel, Ricciardo, approached from behind, and then the same happened with Max. I gave him some room just in case he had a bit of tire lockup, but then obviously he had a big one and that's why we crashed. I think he realized he was wrong. We were both lucky to continue but it was not necessary. However. I appreciated the fact he came to me straight away because that's the way to solve things like this, face to face. But obviously this is not the result we were looking for. Verstappen, who had a race ending impact with Lewis Hamilton in Bahrain before China, will hope for a less eventful race, while Vettel will hope to be back amidst the front of the grid at the Azerbaijan Grand Prix on April 29.